everyone, I'm Marlena Harold with Brevard County Libraries and today for Library Con On Demand, we're going to talk about a little more complicated way to add coded lights to your cosplay. All right, so there are a couple of simple ways where you can add glowing effects to your cosplay if you're short on time and resources. One of my favorites is simple glow sticks. They're cheap, they're available at lots of different stores, and they're pretty flexible. They'll glow for your event, and even afterwards, if you have a black light, they're still very fluorescent looking, so it'll still add a nice effect to your cosplay. Another really great item to use is fluorescent paint. This glows under a black light as well. You can kind of see it on the lid there. I use that in this Yondu headband, and you can see how it lights up under a black light here and you've got the paint and the glow stick here. So cheap, easy, and fast. All right, so this is what the inside of the sword looks like. This is the Circuit Playground Express and the NeoPixel lights. It has alligator clips and they just clip right onto the board, so easy to use. The lights actually can be programmed to be any different color you want, so right now they're actually programmed to show up blue. And when we show you the sword, you'll actually hear a sound effect that the board can make. And this is all stuff that you can code with make code. All right, another really simple way that you can add a light to your costume, if you have a prop that you're making, perhaps you just need one light for it. Um, something that this could work for is maybe like a Harry Potter wand, is just simply taking an LED and a coin battery and what you do is you take the positive and the negative legs, just stick them on the appropriate side of the battery, and it'll light up just like that. It completes a circuit. You have a light that will last through your event. I've actually tested these, and this will last several days. So you can have a light that will work for your costume for a different event or um, just if you, if you want to test out a prop, this is a solid way to have one single light for your costume. Do you like to make fiber arts projects? Do you want to sew your LEDs into your costume? Well, these are a way that you can do that. You can use conductive thread, a sewing needle, and very simple LEDs that actually have holes where you can put your conductive thread through as you're sewing. This is from, um, this is a lily pad, and it actually comes with other options where you can um, make your lights twinkle. There's a small board for that. There's a switch that you can sew into your circuit as well. So these are really simple things that you can program or you can use ones that are already programmed and you can give different effects to lights that you actually sew into your costumes. So this is a little more advanced, but if you have those sewing skills and you wanna try a fiber arts project, this would be a way to do that for your costume. <laughs> 